Hello everyone and welcome to Hoko Life. My name is Melanie B. It is now Wednesday the 17th of winter. So it is the fishing tournament day. We'll go outside and see Darius right away. But first let's make the weather a little bit better. Okay, where is Darius? Ah, Melanie B, how's it going? Our little fishing has, tournament has begun, it's all very exciting. Try and catch as many sculpin as you can before 8 o'clock. Okay, so let's see where we can find that. I think it's over by the pond. Yeah. So we'll have to head over there to do that. Let's see if anyone's already scoring anything. Okay, everyone's still at zero. Let's get over to the grove. Okay, so might as well get started right away. Let's see what we get here. Come on, fishies, bite right away. I think I need to find, get 10 of these to get a gold trophy. But I started off with an old boot. Very nice. <laughs> Come on, little fishy. Give me a scalping, please. Is this going to be a sculpin or is this another boot? A uh, black crap heat. <laughs> uh, not the fish I want. I'm gonna have to get these chests right away because there's not much space around here. Come on, are we gonna find a scalpin at all? I think I need to have a minimum of four. There we go, it's just it. Might be another black crappy, but we'll hope for a scalping. Nope, a tadpole. This has got to be one. Finally, got our first one. Let's keep going. There might be something back here. Let's see if we got another one. And number two. And we'll see if we can find another one. And number three. These ones are hard to find. I think I'm only gonna try for four. And finally, number four. 
Okay, so we don't have any space in our backpack now. Um, let's collect all of the cash we have. Nope, I didn't collect the cash, did I? Uh, let's drop the old boot. We'll collect... Oh my goodness, I don't want to collect the boot. I want to drop it. Oh, I dropped it all the way over here and I still collected it. Let's try that again. Drop. Gotta avoid the boot. There we go. Now I can take all of the cash out of there. Now we will get the boot. Okay, so let's head back over to the seaside. I'm pretty sure four is the amount you have to get to get a trophy. And all I really want is a trophy because those ones were hard to find. Oh no, I need to get six. Okay, so I'll have to get a couple more. And let's see if we can put some stuff away in here. We'll leave the boot there. We'll leave the black crap here. And I'll hang on to the two scalpins we've caught so far. Okay, so I'll head back over to the grove okay let's collect two more of these sculpins and then we'll head over to see Oma Okay, we've got number six and some more treasure. So we'll collect that. And now we can head over to the town center. And there's something on the notice board. Ramish wants the interior of their house changed. Sure, we can do that. And let's see what's in the donation bin. So we've got some stone, some silver, light, and yellow petal flowers. I don't have a lot of space. Yeah, I'll leave that for now. And we've got a delivery for Oma. Hello, Oma. Hi, Melanie B. Uh, here we go. So, three potatoes. Two cabbage. And two daikons. These ingredients look great. Thank you, Melanie B. Have a white skirt as a little thank you. Okay, thank you very much. Let's see which order that was for. So it was a simple stew, three potatoes, two cabbage, two daikons, yeah. Okay, let's see our achievements now on that. So for cooking, Boots created 30 of 30. And we're at six still for villager food requests. So we still need four more. Okay. 
Let's go see what Moss has in his shop today. Okay, a bed. <laughs> a rice cooker and a simple lamp. Okay, nothing particularly exciting, but there is a pink wall paint now. Uh, I might order that eventually. Okay, let's head over to the small woods. I wanted to do a little outdoor vendor area. Okay, let's make some better weather. There we go. So I wanted to set up an outdoor vendor stall area and I found this really nice, uh, some nice designs. This is an art stall and the creator code for that one is 3N9EAL3D and we also got a vendor stall from the same creator code. and a little bench swing, and that's also the same creator code. So let's see if we can't place these in here someplace. Let's get that back about that much. And we'll put in the, looks like some hats and sunglasses, super cute and very colorful. Let's see if we can get this in here. Not quite. Maybe let's... Oops. Not that. I don't want to move that. <laughs> there we go. Let's see if we can move this over a bit. And we'll have to move the balloons now. Okay, can we get past? Yeah. Now let's see if we can get this in here in the corner. Well, not quite in the corner, but close. And we'll put in, can I get it back a little more? Hmm, seems that is as far back as it will go. Maybe if I try placing this piece in the corner first, I can get it to fit a little bit better. Okay, let's try that. Um, let's rotate it a little bit more. Uh, 
so close. Maybe that will work. <laughs> now let's try putting this one right next to it. Yeah, that looks a little bit better. And we'll put the bench as a seating area. And maybe we can have it right around here. Let's try rotating it. No, that's not going to fit here at all. <laughs> hmm, okay, it might fit here. Rotate it the other way. There we go, that'll be fine. Um, let's see if we can't get some more path, pathing to fit in here. Maybe that's too big. Come on, let's get this in. That's kind of overlapping. Sometimes things look like visually they will fit, but they don't. Let's rotate it a little bit more. Nope, not gonna fit. That one fits there. Let's try another small one. Are you gonna fit? It's so strange how it fits over, like it overlaps <laughs> on certain spots. And then places where it looks like there's nothing, it won't go in. And I made some floor lighting. And let's see if we can get these in here. And place one there. And we'll place another one there. Maybe we can get one by the balloon. One can go there. Okay, I think maybe one more. Let's see if we can put one right here. There we go. Great. So this is the outdoor little vendor stall. We'll pretend it's summertime. <laughs> Okay, so let's get back. Yeah, I want to double check to make sure. I've got six on the board. Oops. Yep, says I've got six, so that's going to give me a bronze trophy, and that's good enough for me. <laughs> so I'll just need to check on the crops. Down to the farm we'll go. Okay, let's just turn the brain on right away.
Okay, and is that ready? Not quite. Chart is ready. Let's grab all these. And it looks like the eggplants are ready too. We will take those. So now we'll need to figure something else out to plant here instead. I think we're running low on potatoes. And possibly some onions. But I don't know if those are in season right now. That's not ready, but these eggplants are. We'll grab these as well. Okay, so we got 9 charred, 18 eggplants. Hello, Aubrey. Hi, Melanie B. I'd give you a hug, but I'd probably be, I'm probably covered in soil. Um. Maybe we'll do some Brussels sprouts. And... I know I need potatoes. Yeah, that's available this season. Let's do a bunch of potatoes. There we go. So let's get Brussels sprouts right here. And we'll replace the potatoes where the aubergines were. And over here too. Perfect. Okay, let's head back over to our house. And we can call it a day. Okay, here we are, town center. And Quill wants the interior of their home done. I think we can do that. And I don't think Oma needs anything else. So we'll probably head over to the farm. But I think that's going to be it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching.